And uh, just to let you know, this camera, this camera is filming this. So that's kind of neat. Isn't that kind of neat? Okay. Uh, we got a, a double double cheese. Uh, well, it's just a burger deluxe. Let's uh, let's get some paint down on there. And, and, and let's get started here, guys. Okay, got the big brush. And let's get some burgers going. Let's get that burger going here. Mm. Mm. And, you know, it's been a while since I've made burgers. I You know, because we've been kind of... Uh, well, we've been sort of handicapped on, on many levels, uh, mentally and then, of course, physically in terms of the equipment, uh, changing over the equipment, new equipment here at uh, Fast Food, you know, new sort of, uh, well, it's just, uh, we, we just have sort of been out uh, out to lunch uh, here at Fast Food Paintings. All right, so uh, we got the buns going on here. Let's go ahead, and, and I was talking earlier how how I don't, uh, you know, get tired of making hamburgers um, all the time, and uh, and yet uh, here I am again making another hamburger, and and why why am I still? Wh wh where is the fun? Where is the fun here? And why am I finding uh, somehow enjoyment in this process again? Uh, it's a good question. Uh, and and I and I I'm not really sure I can answer it except for the fact that I do I uh, do enjoy uh, you know the painting process I do enjoy that and, and I think that's really where where it all comes down to uh, more so than than what I'm actually painting uh, but there's there's like fun discoveries I, I kind of you know the little dribble there I love that I'm, I'm sort of addicted to that kind of stuff. And, and so uh, maybe that's really what the story is behind the, the veil. I haven't really, you know, gone into a psychoanalysis with the reasoning behind it. But, uh, but maybe I should. Maybe I should. 818-528-4516. We're painting a hamburger here. Finally uh, getting a little painting done for you. And uh, this is a Burger Deluxe. Uh, let's get a pickle in there somehow. And, uh, and, and some cheese. Let's get the cheese on top of the, the patty. Lettuce. Oh boy, gotta get some lettuce on there. That little sound is uh, not something that I care to hear. The, but what the heck? It's not something I want to, you know, keep on hearing. It's it's kind of annoying, but it is there, uh, and it's it's just because the bristles are 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 such in such a way that they do that. And it's kind of a shitty brush, uh, frankly. So that's why we're getting that kind of sound. Okay, so let's uh, try to work some shadows here while we're at it. Yeah, I, I, that's that's kind of annoying, frankly. Let's go to our bigger brush here. Less, see, there's less sound, and it's not that it's a better brush. It's, it's made by the same uh, shitty brush company that I like to buy from. Uh, you know, I like to buy cheap brushes. So I think it's just the size of the brush, kind of the, the limitations. And actually, it, it, this is doing it too. So I can't really explain exactly what the deal is. But it, but it is a deal, nevertheless. All right. Well, uh, that looks good. Let's get a little pickle in there somewhere.
I, I don't know. I didn't like where that pickle went. You know what I mean? Let's just forget that we had a pickle. The pickle is inside there somewhere. There's shadows. Let's get some shadows from the tomato. And that burger is a little too burnt. So let's go ahead and lighten it up. And uh, let's go some highlights again on, on maybe where the, the tomato uh, highlights. Uh, and maybe a shadow. Let's get let's do a shadow. For, you know, burgers on on something. It's not necessarily floating. Let's give it a shadow. I know. Let's put some, uh, um, like, uh, mayonnaise. A blob of mayonnaise up there. Yeah. I find, too, actually, when you buy a burger at a fast food restaurant, they sometimes are a little too liberal with the mayonnaise. I, I don't need as much mayonnaise sometimes that they put on there. It's, uh, it's a little much. And I think it's, you know, that's just, uh, that, that's sometimes a, uh, more to do with whoever was preparing that burger, and it was their personal taste uh, on how much, you know, mayonnaise that they want to put on their burger. Uh, my, I myself rather not have actually any mayonnaise on my burger. I'm just more of a ketchup kind of guy. But, uh, but they, it, uh, it can't not, you know, it's not necessarily that bad uh, to have a little mayonnaise on your burger. Okay, let's, I think we're done. Let's just put a little sesame seeds here, guys. There you go. Okay, there, there you go. Uh, we have a uh, lovely burger here. A deluxe, burger deluxe. Why don't we fix that shadow there? Let's fix the shadow here. Okay. And uh, there you go. Let's see if we can get a shot of that. You want some Thousand Island dressing on that? Uh, you know... Well, we put, we put the mustard in there, but yeah, maybe a little bit of Thousand Island. So let's give it a little bit of a red pinky thing. Uh, maybe just uh, off uh, somewhere, off, you know, just another blob of something. All right, just a hint, just a hint, yeah. And then we'll come back in with some shadow. All right, uh, there you go. Uh, Burger Deluxe, guys.